Hello cookbook friend, welcome to the Cookbook Divas YouTube channel. My name is Katie. Today I wanted to talk about Cake Chronicles. This is by Anna Zellick. She has her own blog that's called Anna's Baking Chronicles. If you guys want to check that out first before you go and commit to the book and then you've got this cake book and now you have to eat all the cake in the world. So this cake is, I mean this cake is always appealing, but this book is appealing because I mean, the cover with this gorgeous cake, what's not to love? This is exactly what I would want for my birthday. So let's look at all of this stuff. There's 60 awesome recipes in here. Uh, I think it's all cake oriented. So we can see beautiful cake photos. Um, Here we go. Table of contents. So we have decadent chocolate, spring blossoms, summer on a plate, luscious and nutty, the holidays, and then classic elegance. I kind of like that if you've got somebody who has a spring birthday, you can find a spring oriented cake. You could do winter, you could do fall. I like that she's been able to divide this up a little bit like holidays, seasons, a little bit of everything. So that's really cool. Again, gorgeous photos and there's different kinds of cakes. Let's see if I can move so that you guys can see this a little better. Wow. The fact that I might be able to make this is amazing. All right, let's see. Ooh, okay, so she does give step-by-step -step photos, which is great, um, especially for elaborate cakes like this, because I know that it can be very complex, and it's nice to see kind of a top-down view of all of this stuff happening. Very cool. Okay, so starting off strong with chocolate, we have... Ooh, hazelnut espresso chocolate cake. Look at how smooth that frosting is. I, I'm just amazed. That's beautiful. Let's move on to a different one. Not every, uh, not every recipe has a photo, which kind of, kind of a bummer, but that's okay. Not everyone needs one, I guess. Here's another one, peanut butter chocolate cake. I think a lot of people would love this one. Let's see. We've got a Bonofi. It's hard to see. Chocolate walnut cake. Interesting. This looks really good. I think it has banana slices of banana on the top. This looks beautiful. I love that. So, oh, it's a banana. Banana chocolate banana cake. Okay. So here we go. Um, what we have here is we've got she doesn't even really give a blurb, which, you know, I'm not somebody that goes and reads through every part of every cookbook. So for me, that's kind of a bonus. So she has all of the ingredients listed on the left hand side and she's divided it up into here's your batter, here's your frosting, here's your toppings. So that's really nice and helpful. Um, she has all of the instructions right here and she's even um, emboldened a few things that are kind of important. So for instance like while the cakes are cooling finish the buttercream. So she kind of leads you step by step exactly how she would make the cakes, which is great. Let's see if I can find other cake. And this one's quite elaborate, like the chocolate ganache, and we've got the cake, we've got the caramelized bananas. So we've got a cookie dough brownie cake. That's awesome. Ooh, caramelized white chocolate hazelnut cake. That one would be super decadent. Wow. We have a honey lavender berry cupcake. Cool. Okay, so she doesn't just have big cakes. She goes into, you can even do cupcakes. I wonder if she has like rolls also. That would be cool. I'm sure she has loaves. Strawberry elderflower cake. Everything just looks really beautiful in this cookbook. Very elegant. Oh my goodness. Uh, this is a Earl Grey a blackberry white chocolate cake. I love the painterly. I might I, I hope you guys can see this, but it kind of goes from this really light pink all the way to a really dark like maroon color. It's really quite beautiful. Um and being able to learn those kinds of techniques is really cool. I like that she has given us uh all kinds of cakes to be able to learn these various techniques that we could use on cakes that maybe we want to make ourselves. This is a orange blossom ricotta bundt cake. This is very simple, very cool. 
Um, I do think overall for, uh, I'm not seeing any gluten-free, by the way, for anybody else that needs gluten-free, I need gluten-free. So that's something I look for. But one thing I am uh, noticing is that this isn't a easy book. Um, it does seem like a lot of these recipes are quite elaborate. I think there are some easy cookbooks, but there's no indication whether or not it is easy or if it isn't easy. So like this one, the mango coconut cake, this one looks fairly easy and it looks good. But a lot of these cakes require a lot of time, a, a lot of patience. Cinnamon spice blueberry cake. Yummy. That looks good. But like this mojito cake, if you can see how many instructions are over here. Yeah, there's a lot going on. So uh, I think overall, if you are somebody that is really, oh, here's the mojito cake, like an actual photo. This is cool. It actually kind of looks like a glass with the rim on the top. That's really cool. I think if you're somebody that is uh, is a more advanced baker, somebody comfortable baking, this is a great book. And if you want to dive into your cake making skills, you know, this is the perfect cookbook for that. If you're a beginner baker, you might want to start off with something a little more easy, or you're just going to have to navigate through this book and kind of <laughs> try and, you know, maybe fail and then have to try again, which is fine. Coconut cream almond cake. Ooh, wow. This beautiful dusting on this cake is really cool. I love it. This is really awesome. Uh, my birthday is coming up, so I'm been, I've been like seeking cakes. Oh, oh, this is a cake. I got I, I got confused because there's cookies on top of the cake. That's actually quite a great idea. Uh, this would be great for the holidays. Let's see. Clementine cram cranberry layer cake. Ooh, that's yummy. That's so good. Pistachio white chocolate cheesecake. Wow. I'm going to have to save this for my friend who, <laughs> she loves this stuff. Ah, oh, this is a really awesome uh, cake book. We have a chocolate yellow birthday cake. Very classic. Um, Yeah. If you guys love baking sweet cakes and whatnot, this is a really cool cookbook for that. There's a lot of really cool techniques you'll learn throughout. Really cool flavors too. There's all kinds of stuff I've never seen before. So definitely check out Cake Chronicles. You can also check out her blog, which I've listed in the description down below. Um, Cause Anna, Anna Zellick has a lot of really awesome recipes, not just cake, like she's got cookies and all kinds of cool stuff. Um, if you guys are looking for more cookbooks to kind of add to your collection, join us on Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest. We also do a podcast every Friday. So if you're looking for brand new cookbooks or want to know what cookbook news is out there, come join us over there. Uh, make sure to share this uh, this channel with your friends. Uh, we love hearing from everybody. If you guys have cookbook suggestions of things you want us to look over, let us know in the comments down below. Also, let us know how we're doing. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see you next time.